This morning, my boys and I were looking at some videos on YouTube and we typed in spider carts. Found some really cool projects that folks had going on. Uh, compared to those, this one's quite simple. Uh, there's no roll cage. Uh, there's only a six and a half horse engine. Uh, but in any case, there's uh, certainly some things we can do to maybe up, upgrade this unit. Um, the tires and rims on uh, this go-kart, uh, we've got those from a four-wheeler, motorcycle, snowmobile, salvage yard here in our area. Uh, they were $10 a piece, so that saved us some money. Uh, the front suspension is uh, basically the same as the plans. Uh, we made all the components versus uh, buying any of them. Uh, the pivot points are all uh, pressed in with brass bushings, so uh, nice and smooth operation. The hubs for all four corners obviously had to be special made just to fit up to the, the bull hole pattern uh, for these particular rims. Uh, there is a hydraulic unit that came off an Articat snowmobile that's been mounted to the side of the frame. Uh, it's basically a handlebar mount, so it looks like there's a handle there, but that's linked up to the front pedal. And then in the back, um, again, the hubs had to be made special to hook up to uh, these particular rims, but uh, the gas tank has been decoupled from the engine, so the engine could get slid up just a little bit closer to the center of the go-kart. And then notice that this engine does not move with the swing arm. It's, uh, it's attached directly to the frame, so a little bit different drive setup uh, here. Uh, the pivot points are a little bit different again as the plan had suggested, but in any case, uh, we worked with what we had here around the shop. Uh, it was a really fun project to work on, and uh, maybe through the course of this winter we can, we can work on a couple more updates. Thanks.